Hello, fellow retrievers, and welcome to the first day of the spring semester. This is a welcome back for many, but I want to extend special greetings to all of the students, faculty, and staff who are new to our community. To our new students, I hope you will take part in our Welcome Week activities that began on Friday and continue all week long. Please visit welcomeweek.umbc.edu for information about events and resources for new undergraduate and graduate students. Whether you are transferring into UMBC, starting mid-year, or resuming your education after a break, we are thrilled you have joined us. Today, on this first day of classes, I am inspired. To be sure, these continue to be challenging times in our world, in our society, and on college campuses. Here at UMBC, our work on issues concerning free speech, respectful discourse, and an environment that is safe and welcoming to all will carry forward in substantive ways this semester. You will hear from other members of our leadership team very soon about some of that work, including new initiatives and opportunities for you to take part. This work is not a one-off. It is not just a reaction to the moment or a response to any one set of voices. This work is larger than that. It is fundamental to who we are and who we will become. It is core to our vision and values and to our ability to evolve as a university that serves the public good. After all, it is a university's mission to pursue inquiry and advance knowledge. We strive for understanding and we work for peace and justice for all humanity. So that is why I am inspired today. Additionally, my senior team and I have a long list of action items for this semester. Things that we all know need to get done and that we do not need to wait for a strategic plan to be finished. At the same time, we will continue on a thoughtful path toward our future, informed by what we heard in last year's bold conversations and by the feedback we received in the fall from shared governance leaders on how best to engage the entire UMBC community in strategic planning. Our aims will be bold, like UMBC itself. As we articulate our priorities, we are not merely making a to-do list. We are recommitting to our values and setting an example for the rest of the world. We will chart a course for the future of inclusive excellence. To do so, we need all your voices. We need your ideas, your commitment, and your energy. I am so excited to get started and I look forward to working with all of you. Thank you and happy first day of classes.